been waiting for the show heard around the world it's time live from the food fight live studios in houston texas food fight live hosted by Chris Wilson and Mike Benoit. Y'all didn't expect that, did you? Come on, man. Come on, man. Ain't no damn way. Ain't no way he gonna show up here at no five o'clock. Oh, hell. Anyway. Hey. I'm going to say this probably a few times, but there is absolutely zero possibility. And I mean zero possibility that I uh, can sit here for all these hours and not, you know, take a piss or get something to drink. (laughs) So we're going to have a little uh, brief interruptions here and there, here and there. But yeah, what are y'all doing on this lovely, uh, it is nice outside today. It's hot though. Saturday. The only way to watch the uh, early prelims is get the stupid fight pass. I had to pay 10 bucks for that bastard. So, that sucked. I was like, well, that's dumb. But yeah. So, there, that's how I have it. What's up, boozy? It's Eric, Andrew. But uh, let me get that out the way. So, yeah, it's going to be as a, a long, a long, yeah, imagine that. A long, a long day. So we're going to talk about everything that we can talk about to get this motherfucker going. I needed to check something, though. So. Talks amongst yourselves for just a moment, please. Uno momento, por favor. Por favor. All right. So, there we go. I just want to make sure it was uh, it was working. But, yeah, I know he's got, he's got that. Uh, well, I don't even know what show that is. Let's look it up. No. Orleans. Concert. Okay. So he's like going to see There we go. Today. He's going to Primus. 
A Perfect Circle, and Pussifer. That's what he's going to see. And that show start gates open at 6.30. Show at 8. So that means he would leave here at 7. Even if he got here at 5, he'd be here two hours max. Max. But I imagine they're going to get there at 6.30. So they can get situated. That means he would only be here for 30 minutes. So that's how that worked. But yeah, that's who he's going to see. Primus, Perfect Circle, and Pussifer. But yeah. Dude, she needs to like be done anyway, dude. Ain't she like lost every fucking thing lately? I don't think she's, I don't think she's, uh, I don't think she's won anything, dude. Like nothing. Like absolutely not a damn thing. I know her record is salty. Especially now. Uh, Holly. Home. Sure, dog. That's the way you got to look. Yeah, 15 and 6, dude. Uh, I guess she won against Santos. And then she won against Kate Caitlin. Or she lost against Caitlin. Then she won against Irene and Pennington. But that was in 2020. And no contest against Silva overturned. So, yeah. So, yeah, I mean, she, she won Santos in last year, but then that other one was a no contest. They was overturned that dude. But, yeah. Uh, 17. I mean, she went, on a, she went on a major losing streak. And you know what? I'm sitting here. I'm watching. Dude, I, I'm like staring at this right this second. And it said... Early prelims only. Here, look at this. UFC Fight Pass. Watch on UFC Fight Pass. Right here. Now, if you go up to prelims, it's like ESPN. Right? Fight Pass. So, I got it. I'm look, I'm watching it on, on uh, ESPN because I have that one up. Oh, dude. She looks like she's like... Hmm. A lot of people think she looks good. I, I mean, she looks rough, dude. Like rough to me. Oh, ugh. There's no, f- no, hell no. Mm-mm. But dude, right, right. I, I mean, I had to come, I had to come investigate on this. They're showing it on there. I wish I would have known that because I would damn sure not have bought the freaking stupid fight pass. Because that's what it act like had to happen. They try, they scam me. They scam me. Look at them scam me. Ain't that a bitch? Well, fight pass is like way behind anyway. So I'm going to like get rid of that so I can. Let's see, live there. I'm just trying to get everything together, y'all. Trying to get in here early. It was like, uh... so there we go. All right. Oh, Fig, he's out there now. YouTube has all has YouTube has all fight pass halls. Yeah. Well, I mean, I thought it was like on. Uh... Like YouTube TV has Fight Pass? What? No. But I'm saying ESPN has the the freaking the fight uh, fight pass. But it was like only on ESPN or only on Fight Pass. That's what it said. Now it's now it's on ESPN Plus, and that's like where I'm watching it. That's 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 a uh, scam me a little bit there. Out of ten dollars, bastards. But uh, yeah, he's getting greased up right now. Dude. I'm, I'm, the timers are going to be a little messed up because they put that bar right. If y'all are watching this at all with me, uh, they put a little bar at the bottom when when it's not the main card. Free on YouTube and pay on. Oh well, that's bullshit. Hey Cheryl, what's going on? 
So the timer is going to be a little off, but I'm going to adjust it as we get going. So that way, I because I, I, I everything is all fucked up. I hate that. Dude. It drives me absolutely insane when that happens. But ain't nothing I can do about it. But yeah, that's bullshit. Boozy. Charged me this money for nothing. No one knew was scamming my ass. I can't even bleed. Can't even bleed. Oh, yeah, you right. Where the hell is that sign? Oh, I got to Dude, I ain't even like... Where the hell is it at? There it is. Right there. Help wanted. Hey, l- let me tell y'all something. I get I get freaking what you call it's on that. Like, people actually send me emails. Like, hey, I, I noticed that uh, you're needing help. I think I would be... Like, they, they, like, send me all uh, like like all kinds of emails. This shit is fucking funny. I mean, I appreciate him trying to help a brother out. But, yeah. There we go. I had to fix that, too. So, yeah, when this when the, when the fight gets going, I will... Uh, fast forward 10 seconds. You're still live? All right, fast forward 10 seconds. You are live? Okay. I'm a little off here. I'm going to pause this one up top. Okay. But yeah, it's like, uh, there we go. But I'll, I'll fix it. Boozy, that ain't, that, ain't that some bullshit, dude? Scam the hell out of us right there. Just give us a good old fashioned scam. It's like, oh, we're going to get some extra $10. Watch this. Watch this. Uncle Bruce is calling him up now. Here we go. Will Cody pull this off? Hey, I, I'm. A, mm, mm. I think this is gonna be a good one. If I watch you on Y55, it will not let me chat on the phone. Anyone know a fix? On the 55 inch, it will not let me chat on the phone. Oh, I don't know what kind of TV you have, Cheryl. But I know if you like stream it up there, it may it may do it. I'm gonna fix that timer while we're going, so everybody relax. I'll get it. I'll get it happening. But I gotta get it going first, because I don't know where the hell they're gonna put it. Because this it's always normal. All right, right off the bat, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Garbrandt right off the bat in there with a nice low calf kick. Again, working that lead leg. Dude, Cody is not messing around. He's still watching those hands, but he's just easing in there, working that lead leg outside, outside two times, inside one time. Still lead leg. Nice leg kicks. I think Cody needs this though, right? He tried to act like he was going to do some damn Bruce Lee shit and did not and gave up on it real fast. Figure, oh, Fig's acting like he, he, I mean, he's switching those hips, acting like he's going to do something, but he ain't jumped on it yet. He ain't jumped on it yet. I need to get that timer. Give me just a minute. I'll, 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 I'll jump on it. Oh, my God, dude. Cody just kicked a low calf kick. I mean, and he put some mustard on it. Who faked that la- fake that calf kick and it went upstairs with a nice two piece left then right I mean hard oh they uh, oh did they headbutt holy it was like each of them went to go do something but didn't didn't do something but and they slammed heads even the ref is over here like this I mean dude they just ran fucking forehead to forehead I don't see anybody leaking but they that was hard I don't know how if it was loud there I, can, I wish I could hear but. No, I mean, it, that shit was crazy. Fig tried to, or Cody tried to come in there with a the left and a right hand. Fig ducks up underneath it, goes for a double, but gives up on it real quick. Gives up on it real quick. Glass chin. Whoo, he tried to go upstairs with a high kick. Fig kicked him right in the midsection. He dropped down, but he popped right up real fast. That chin wasn't so suspect. Their heads are hollow. <laughs> That chin hasn't been suspect in the, but I mean, lately, 
It's been, mm, it's not been any bass. It's definitely not been any bass. But yeah, Fig's, Fig's starting to get a little bit more aggressive. Tried to hit him with an overhand right. Swing and a miss on that check. Gave up on that check left. Oh, he did kick him right in the jaw as Cody went upstairs to show the replay. I did not see that from the other angle. Cody popped right back up, though. That glass jaw is uh, maybe, maybe got a crack in it. Maybe got a crack. Fig acts like he's going to come in with a nice left and a right hand. Gave up on that real quick. Cody moves out of the way to his right side. They're still like, it's like they're still trying to fill each other out. Heavy inside leg kick again for Cody. It's like they're trying to figure each other out because it's not been like real aggressive. And Fig hasn't done a whole lot. I mean, he's been like kind of hesitant on what he's going to do. I don't know if he's just looking for a spot. But other than Cody trying to go upstairs with that high kick and, and him getting kicked in the face, Fig again tried to go in there with a nice front kick to the mouth, but just out of reach. So yeah, I don't I don't know if he's trying to to work on that or not. I need to work on this timer. Let me work on that too at the same time. Hold on. But yeah, I mean it's just a lot of a lot of this. Like a lot of like like they're gonna like like they're gonna do something, but nobody ever does anything. Go Brandt, uh, Garbrandt tried to go over top with a nice right hand. Fig shoots down, tries to get a hold of a couple. They roll around on the ground for just a second. Both men back to their feet. Heavy leg kick. Calf kick right there is nasty. Heavy calf kick from Fig. Whoo, look at Cody. Left, then right. Big ones right off the face. Fig act like it didn't mean nothing, but we all know. We all know what that means when they smile. Shit, that means that shit stung. Let me get a timer so I can start working on it because I am like not right this second whoo fig act like he's gonna throw a right hand and lunged in there with a nice check left look real good but i mean i'm telling you it's a lot with these it's like i mean if this was a fighting boy i mean they would be whipping the shit out of each other but nobody's doing anything lots of flinching with the hands lots of flinching Fig tried to go in there with a nice front kick to the midsection. Gave up on it. Tried to hit him with a check right. Gave up on that as well. So did Cody. Fig shoots down there for a double. Tries to give up on it. Doesn't give up on it. Gabs a hold to a single. Then the ankle tries to run him down to the ground. Fig jumps up, up on top of him. Did not work that time, but hit him with a nice right hand in the clinch right there. A little dirty box, and then they separate, and then back to the middle they go. Cody again with a nice, uh, nice calf kick there. Let me get rid of that timer. I'll work on it. I'm just try, I'm trying to. I was hoping that they uh, fixed. Yes, thank you. But yeah, I was hoping that uh, there'd be a little bit more action, but I guess not. Who's fighting? Uh, ain't you showing us? I'm t- I'm talking to you about it over here on Twitch, buddy. But yeah, when you if you're on Twitch, if you look on that right screen, it shows you right there, Fig and. And uh, Garbrandt's fighting. But right now they're on break. I'll have the timer up here in just a minute. Give me just a second to get that going. But, uh, yeah, I mean, look at that. Five strikes, 13, round one. It's like not really good. You know, I mean, it was very lackluster. I figured it would have been a little bit more excited, a little bit more excitement. But I think both I mean both guys need it. And they may just be a little shy right off the bat. What's up, Degler? Hell, just chilling, buddy. Getting going with this uh early prelims. Something I don't ever do, but I can't miss this. I, I thought I couldn't miss this fight. Apparently I could have missed the shit out of it. All right, here to go round number two. And I'll, I'll get that up here for you in just a second. I am working on it. Cody tries to go upstairs with a high kick. Fig's being a little bit more aggressive now. I mean, getting real close to him. Before, there was like two, three feet in there. Tried to lunge in there with a check right. Gave up on it. Cody tried to pop him with another right hand. Hits him again, ripping right hand down the middle. Check left works real good. Fig runs around the backside of him, grabs a hold of the waist, puts one leg between both legs and trying to drive, bring him down. Gets him down. Cody's trying to turn back into him, but Fig's using his right leg to trap his right leg so he can't roll back into him. It does not work. Fig crawls over into a modified half guard there. 
sitting up on the right hip of Cody. Now he's got his right arm right around the back side of the neck. His the back of his head's kind of like underneath the right armpit as he's trying to, he's trying to crawl around the backside, which he does. Flattens Garbrandt out on his on his belly. Cody's hanging on to both wrists real good. Fig Fig's hands is like up underneath Cody. I mean, I don't know if he's if he's digging in there, but he's trying to pull out. And it is not working. All right, he finally gets it out there. Cracks him with a nice right hand, does Fig. Cody's in a bad situation, having to roll into him and get into full mount. Not good. Not good. Fig's trying to crawl over into a... That's an arm in choke. I don't know how deep it's... Is that deep? Uh-oh. That arm in choke... Oh, he's stepping over. Uh-oh. He Now Garbrandt's in trouble. That arm in choke is deep, son. It's deep. Fig's needs to move just a little bit more. Garbrandt's breathing hard, mouth wide open. Wide open is the mouth. Three minutes to go round number two. I mean, he's got a long time to be in this situation. Garbrandt's trying to hang on to him. His arm is like bent up like this. So his forearm is between their faces. So Fig can't quite get that arm in there and, and, and choke him. So he his elbow is way up high like this right here. So Fig can't, he can't quite get it tight enough. Cody's still breathing. Fig finally gives up on it because that arm was up real high. Crawls back into full mount there. I'm trying to work the timer at the same time, dude. Let me... Oh, damn it, transform. He's still in that position. He's still not let go of that arm in choke yet. He's trying to pull Cody's left arm up underneath him like a weird arm bar. Or I don't, I don't know what that was. Cody just like pushed off real hard. Tried to crawl back up. Get, trying to get up. It did not work. Fig just lays flat. Pushes his like chest forward. Like His sternum is basically on his chin right now. As Cody tried to get out of the way. Hit him with a nice little right hand. Just a little dirty boxing on the ground. Let me get down. I'm still working this timer, y'all. I'm trying to get there. Fig's using his left shoulder and just dropping it right on the cheek. Of Cody, I can't believe Cody's still hanging on this long. He does have one hand around the left arm of Fig, not allowing him to posture up too much. Fig is trying to use his left hand, but as soon as he does, Cody just pulls right back down, trying to keep one arm over on both sides. Yeah, Fig tries to posture up and drop that elbow. Cody does not allow it. Right hand right around the backside, right arm right around the backside of the neck, not allowing him to move at all. Not allowing him to move. Where the hell is the timer? It's way up there. Holy shit. Yeah, Cody tries to turn into him. That did not work. Uh Uh-oh. He may be in a little bit of bullshit now. He may be in some trouble. Figs got him on the back. Body triangle is in deep. That left arm is right around there. Cody's trying to use thing. Boom. Chokes him out. Rear naked, son. Cody had had to tap. And then I didn't even get the fucking timer. Damn it. Yeah, once he rolled over... That arm went there, and Cody tried to grab with both hands, and they just, it was like, I'm falling off a cliff, and dude, he had to tap. That'll go out. That'll go out. It was one or the other. I'll fix that timer here when it's like some bullshit fight, because it is definitely not working. Yeah, I mean, dude, uh, Eric, he, I mean, I don't know if he gave up, but as soon as he got drugged down, he, I mean, Fig put him in a hell of a position when he got around to the backside of him. He did not want to stand and bang. Cody was winning the stand-up game, but that ground game, Fig is for real, dude. He is for real. And then once he tried to, he, then he tried to sit back up again, and as soon as he did, dude, I mean, he cranked down on it. Fig pulled hard, and it was... Tap, tap, tap. That shit, that, 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 that choke was deep. But yeah, goddamn, dude. Yeah, Cody cannot, uh, it's not good. It's not good. He is, uh, he is definitely struggling as of late. Definitely struggling. He looked good on, on, on the stand up, though. And he's got them street beefs. Ugh. It's hard to get in those, dude. Especially when you've been living in those silk sheets at the UFC. Go go over there and get your face beat in. Would nobody save your life? It's like, yay, yay, yay. 
So I don't know if he needs to go there or not. He definitely needs to stay away from it. That would probably be the best option. <laughs> probably be the best option. But yeah, dude, they have that, 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 that. They have the goddamn timer. Like I have to move it way up trying to get to it. I'll, I'll get it on the, on this next one, maybe. I think this one will be a good one, though. I mean, we got two old dogs here, especially with Miller. But you know, Green loves to. He loves to throw them hands. So we'll see how that gets going. Well, I, mm, I think it'll be pretty good, though, to be honest. But yeah, so we got that one. Then we got Andrade and Rodriguez, and then Turner and Marciano. Yusuf, Holm. This is a pretty good card. Pretty good card. I mean, these the last few have been absolutely horseshit <laughs> because everybody's fighting on this summit, but it's like, my goodness. So, I mean, it's been it's been okay so far. What happened to the Nacho guy? Uh, he's doing something. He's he, he's more he's more temporary nowadays. He's like a special guest damn near. And he'll come every so often. But uh I'm going to get some nachos later. Y'all don't get that fucked up. Cuz I'm going to be up here I'm going to need to eat. Oof. I'm going to damn sure need to eat. They, 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 they just doing that uh, post-fight. Right this second. Ben Boy is getting his sex change surgery. Yeah. But he's actually at a concert. So he's... Uh, they announced this on like the 15th of December. He bought his tickets like on December 8th. So I give it to him. But, I mean, it's just Primus. That's what he's going to see. So, I, I mean, it is what it is. It's 300. So, I mean, I, I wasn't missing it. That's why I'm here early, dude. It's like this whole card is pretty good. I say pretty good. This whole card's good. Top to bottom. But, yeah, early prelims starting it off with Cody and Fig. I mean, that's pretty good, dude. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. Pilot point. Oh, look at old. Pilot point in this bitch. Yeah, Jay, he just got into a he got into a situation. On the, but if you just got here, that I mean, the stand up, Cody was fine. You know, Fig was kind of struggling with him, and, and Cody was hitting him. You know, not at will, but I mean, he was popping him. Nice leg kicks, nice inside calf kicks, outside. Nice right and left hands. They headbutted one time, but I mean, they w- Cody was way better on the stand up. But once you go to the ground, I mean, Fig's going, you in for a long day. But yeah, I mean, it's like he jumped on him once he got once he got behind him. I mean, he he that little leg trip, dude. And then it was you got a monkey on you. You know, crawling all around you, no matter where you went, he's right there. So I mean, it's kind of a situation. You're 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 uh, you're in trouble. So they're showing old Bobby Green back there trying to do his thing, and Miller. God damn, old Miller. Uh, who? So what's the odds? Minus one eighty plus one fifty. Where's the fat guy? He is uh, at a concert. He went. There, he's going to see Primus. What's funny is is they're like showing some of these, some of these like past fights from like a long time ago, and you see Jim Miller in them. It's like God damn, that was a long time ago. And my man's still there. What a loser. <laughs> my man got a beard like me. Oh, uh, it's terrible. So put some respect on his name. Yeah, UFC 89. They're showing Miller. 89. UFC 89. Wow. 
We had 300. That's been, that's been a minute, son. Now it's been a minute. Whew. You still sell, selling four wheelers? Uh, no. Oh. Yeah, I wouldn't, uh, I did the finance. Been while I was selling. I was finance. But no, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't been there in like, like, fuck, like three years, two years, three years, something like that. Like three years, maybe. Yeah, it's been a while. It's, it's been a long time. I got Jim fucking Miller on this one. All right, Joe. My man said, I got Jim fucking Miller on this one. We'll see what Bobby Green does, dude. I mean, he he, he loves to throw them hands. But I, I, I think, I think that, uh, he does like to get cocky and put his hands down. And I don't I mean, even though Miller's like he's getting up there. I still I mean, I don't think you want to fuck around too much with Miller. I could be wrong, but you never know. Uh what am I doing now? I own a trucking company. And a uh trucking and uh, they're both looking for that three. Uh, uh, yeah, that three hundred thousand. Oh, that's gonna create some drama, boy. Somebody going, and that's why I figured the Garbrandt fig car fig would be good. Like, I mean, just everybody's trying to get that three hundred thousand. Like, if you're gonna lose, try to you know try to get that extra. But nah. Anal? What? That's aggressive. Does Mikey be see? Yes. Oh, it's got the one shock. You know, like right in the middle of these are just tall chairs. You think I should remove the shock so when he sits down, gets him right in the booty hole? That's kind of mean though, right? To get ass raped by a chair? It's not good. I mean, I wouldn't want that to happen to me. <laughs> There's no way. There is absolutely no way I want to be ass raped by a chair. Especially a gas shock chair. With that 300 every fighter made. Oh, oh dude, Joe, I mean, they are like, everybody trying hard. Before they might have been, oh, I can't do it, I can't. Now everybody's like, nope. Everybody going to make it. Everybody. I mean, that three hundred thousand dollars fight. Some people ain't making three hundred, dude. It's like what? I say some a lot ain't making three hundred to come fight. So there's definitely uh, only guys that wear Callaway hats suck at golf. You're right about that. I was telling a story, but you weren't here last time. We played in, I played in, uh, in the Catalina Foothills in Arizona, dude. Got my ass whipped by some greens, dude. Got my ass whipped by some greens, dude. I three putted like 13 times. I was hitting the ball like so good, but I just, the, the greens were like uphill, downhill, and then down the mountain and up the mountain. And it's like, you think you got to hit it and then you think you don't have to hit it. And you in Tucson? Yeah, I was just up there. I say just, what the fuck am I talking about? It's April. I was there uh, Thanksgiving. But yeah, played up there at, uh, what is that like? It's like, start sort of V. I know it's not Ven Venetian or something what the hell is it V-E I 
Take some. Mm. Vantana. There you go. Vantana. Vantana, something like that, maybe. Uh, they are not walking out. They're still showing some replays. I mean, this one was, a, yeah, there you go, Joe. So, uh, but yeah, I played up there. Dude, I mean, I got my ass whipped. Still shot 89 with 13 three putts. But, uh, I mean, it was it was an ass whipping. I, I, I drove the ball beautifully. I don't know if you played golf there, Joe, or not, but uh, hit the ball beautifully. It's just, oof. I couldn't get the goddamn greens down. It's like it's downhill. Like downhill, but up the mountain, right? You know, it's like that goes up. And it's like I... I could not, I mean, I was like, I was so scared because of the uphill down the mountain putts that I, I just was like, I, I would just touch it. I was so scared. God almighty. And then I, it's like, I wouldn't get it there. And you, I, you know, it's just like, fuck. But yeah, I mean, I, I hit the ball good. My father-in-law was like really helping me out. But a couple of times I would just get into a bad place on those greens and it would just be fucking terrible. It would just be absolutely horrendous. If you just got here, old uh, fig rear naked choke, Garbrandt, so he's had to tap out like a bitch. Here comes Miller right now. Uh, yep. But... uh yeah, I mean, I just couldn't. I mean, he was helping me out because there was a lot of shots that I probably would have went like uh, pin, pin hunting or flag hunting, however you want to say it, and I just didn't. He's like, man, you just need to land it on the front of the green because it's like, like one of the par threes was like one eighty eight, right? He's like, you need, and, and the front of the green is like one forty seven. He's like, hit that number, and it's like, I, I hit it. And, it, and the ball hits, of course, right on the front of that green and just rolled all the way back there. I was like, fuck. How do you, what happens if you got to hit the front of the green? I mean, you better, you got to land it in the rough and hope you get a good bounce. It's like, I mean, it, it, it was a very, the fairways, I think, were very forgiving, but, you know, it's like, it's plenty wide, but the greens are like elevated and then some's down below you, but they're, pr they're, they're like really firm. So, it is what it is. But yeah, my putting was just terrible. Cause I would think it's up the hill. You know, I mean, like, I'm not I'm not talking about like a little, like up the hill. And I would hit it to go up the hill to, you know, 12 footer, right? But it's down the mountain. So it goes by 15 feet. And it's like, what the fuck? So it's like, ugh. Gabe, you played in Gabe City? What? But, uh, but yeah, so it's been, I mean, it was a, uh, it was a challenge. I enjoyed it. It's a beautiful golf course. Yeah, they're on uh, ESPN. I have not played in Gabe City. Bobby Green's coming out now. He's taking his jacket off early, doing a little dance. Oh, he just gave his jacket to somebody in the crowd? And his hat. Look at him. Throwing out a shirt. Gave a shirt to some 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 peoples. Wow. Don't lie. Why are you screaming at me? Oh, uh, Bobby Green's being all fancy. You know how he does. It's like, uh, I'm telling you right now, I think... Uh, he, he, mm, Rest in peace, OJ. Eric, that's aggressive. I mean, we all know he killed his wife, right? At this point in the game, everybody understand that. Everybody got that. I hope so. I bet the, the memes... But the memes lately have been insane, dude. All over. I mean, they've been some good ones. They have been some good ones. I'm going to work on that timer again. I'm hoping I can get close this time. But yeah, they, they, there's been some 
some killer ones. Make sure y'all hit the like button, please. I'm going to be here all freaking day over here. Hit the like button. And if you would like to donate to the show, you can hit that super chat button or you can donate through paypal.me forward slash food fight live. Bronco sales up. Oof. I'm telling you right now, that shit was crazy. Green just come flying in there doing a front flip, dude. Miller all smiling, laughing at him. It's like that. Dude, you is taking such a risk running in there doing a dive and front flip. It's like the fights get, save that shit for afterwards. That way, if you fall down or hurt yourself, Miller's 40, Green's 37, 71 inch reach, 156, 155 and a half pounds, 510 for old Green, 58 for Miller. Whew. 37 and 17, 31 and 15. A little salty. Yeah, I mean, it, it, this I, I'd like to see this one get exciting. I'm gonna try to do the damn timer, but it's like, pff, if shit gets going, boy, I'm gonna be like uh, hanging on. UFC record is twenty six sixteen. Mmm, that's salty. They're calling up Miller right now. He's still bouncing around. He's all excited. They're about to get going, though. They're about to get going. Minus 185 for Bobby Green. I mean, Bobby Green liked to play a lot. That's why he got that salty-ass record. Because <laughs> he likes to mess around. I mean, Uncle Bruce is trying to call him up now, and he's like all over the place. You know what? He did it. Oh, everybody know he did it. I mean, goddamn. I mean, at this point, Miller via hammer fist. All right, Eric. Let's see if you're right, son. All right, here we go. I'm going to try to do the timer again. So, all right, here we go. Right off the bat. No touch gloves, no nothing. Miller comes in there with a nice calf kick. Green just pointing at him, acts like he's going to try to front kick him in the midsection. Gave up on that real quick. Ooh, that one worked. Nice oblique kick for uh, Green. Green comes in, dude. Miller tries to go downstairs with a low calf kick. Green just popped him with a nice left and right hand. Miller gets out of the way. Tried to work that oblique kick again, son. Tried to get it with a left and a right hand. Green acts like he's wiping his face and cracks him with a left hand. Miller with a big right hand. Rolls Green down to the ground. He pops right back up, though. He gives him a good mm-hmm and puts out his lip. Green tried to lunge back in there with a nice right hand. Has to give up on that as Miller comes in there again. Miller ducks out of the way to the left hand. Hits him with a nice check right again. Green, you better, you better put your hands up, son. Miller's trying to come in here again. Green tried to pop him with a right hand down the middle as Miller comes in. Again, Miller ducks out of the way to the left hand, pops back over to the right, cracks him again with that check right. Green has slowed down on the dancing, ladies and gentlemen, real fast. I mean, he has slowed his ass down. He better slow his ass down because I'm here to tell you that shit is not working for him. Trying to get back out of the way again. Miller's still standing right there in front of him. I think Miller's like, I don't give a shit, dude. If I lose or if I win, we're, I'm, go, I'm going for it. M Green's still standing right there in front of him. Miller tries to get out of the way of that left and right hand. It did not work. Right down the middle, left on the side. Green is talking to him, pointing at him. It did not work again. Green tried to pop him again with that left hand. Miller gets out of the way, hits him with his own right hand, and Miller was gone before Green could hit him with his two-piece. Miller's mouth wide open, breathing hard already. My man tired, quick like. Green still trying to work that oblique kick. Hasn't given up quite on it yet. Tried to lunge in it with the left hand. Swinging a miss on those two. Miller comes right back firing with his two pieces. Ain't getting nowhere with them either. Green acts like he's pointing at the right leg. Throws a straight left down the middle. Just touches the forehead. Miller tries to come flying in it with a check right. Has to give up on it as Green pops him again. Two pieces to the midsection, but Green got the better part of that with two hands upstairs. Heavy on the leg kick. Green again moves out of the way to his left side. Pops him with a nice right hand. Miller's still coming, though. Green tries to use that push kick to the front section. Overhand right did not land on that one. 
Miller still coming, though. Green has slowed down on his dancing and getting fancy after Miller cracked him a few times. Miller tries to go downstairs with an inside leg kick. Green made him pay for it big time. Nice overhand left. Miller's still trying to work those leg kicks. Green's getting a little bit more fancy with the left and right hands right down the middle. Try to pop him again with the left hand. Gives up on that right hand just out of reach that time. All green this second. Green tries to spin around with a nice back kick. Did not work either. Oof. They almost head-butted. Miller went to duck in their forehead to sternum, and Green called him again with that check right. Taking a little bit of punishment. 150 to go here. I'm trying to work this stupid thing. But it is not working. Let me go back up this way. I'm trying to pay attention to fight and do this, and it's like I'm way off. Green tries to throw his hands up and get a little bit fancy. That did not work. That did not work. Green still now. Green's talking shit. Nice front kick to the midsection. Nice right hand. Miller sends a nice kick to the body. Green says nah right here on the elbow. Still trying to do his thing again. Green with an overhand right as Miller goes downstairs with a nice calf kick. Called it, Miller's walking into these left jabs. I mean, just walking into them. Green faking that leg like he's going to do that oblique kick. Sends it upstairs. Green or Bobby, Bobby Green trying to do that. It did not work that time, though. Miller's tired, boy. He's, whew, whew. I mean, he's trying to do his thing, but it is not working. 